I finally got my hands on Tiger Woods's favourite club. Let's do it. And let's do it now. Hi everyone, James Robinson here. Guys, first things first. First things first, I'd like to warmly welcome Chris back to the channel, how are we? Very good, yourself? Very good, you, are you boring? I think so, yeah. And I'm fat, but anyway, anyway, fat and boring. Today we are testing the brand new, it is brand new, isn't it? It is. Pretty much, yeah, the brand new TaylorMade MG2 TW grind, and I've been led to believe this is Tiger's favorite club. I believe so. Do you know how I know that? Because I saw an interview with him and they said, Tiger, what's your favorite club? You know what he said? That one. No, we said all of them, so it's got to be up there, isn't it? Oh, well, yeah. So you'd like that, you like what I've done there. Yeah. Right, so guys, we're going to talk you through the new wedge. We're also going to have a bit of a chipping comp. If you don't know Chris, that's gone in a little bit. There we go. If you don't know Chris, check out Chris Dennis Golf for all your short game needs Correct. and requirements. Yes. Um, you may know him from kind of short game Saturdays and things like that. So we're going to put it to the test. I'm going to ask Chris what he thinks about it. Is it a bit of a marketing ploy? Yeah. Or is it an actual thing? Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it now. Yes. Oh, we're on fire today. So, Chris, did you know that this is basically a tailor-made MG2 wedge, but it says TW on it? I did not. Did you not? Did you also know it's available in 60 and 56? I wish it wasn't. <laughs> but they sent me the 56, the guys at TaylorMade, so they must well have known. Well done, TaylorMade. Absolutely. This, the 56 that we've got here, as you can see now, is a 12 degree bounce, whereas the 60 is an 11 degree bounce. That means more to you than it does me. Correct, yeah, so a lot of amateurs normally think that if you're a better player, you normally have less bounce. So Tiger is, again, one of those who has a lot of bounce because he can play more shots. Yeah, and it's also got a geometric sole, so I'll not kind of throw all the information at you, but that basically means that Tiger can kind of open it up, close it down. It can be very, very kind of artistic with it almost. Versatile. Versatile is the word I was looking for. Are you going first or me? I'll go first. So yeah, so you'll have seen Tiger play a lot of shots over the years and he is very much an advocate of moving his ball position, closing the club down or opening it up. So obviously with a lot of bounce and this sole, it allows him to be able to do that, even put it back and still have bounce. Because a lot of times we see people go back, no bounce, digs in. Damien. Yasser Arafat. Damien. Or Damien. So, again, he'll play a bit of a Tiger shot back in the stance. Try and get that go at chasing up. Oh, I'll tell you what, that's probably the winner already. So far, so good. I don't know why I take on a short game expert on chipping competitions, although I won last time. Tailor made, what a wedge. So again. Are you playing all these back then? Or are you going to manufacture some? I might put one forwards if you want. One forwards now. Just yeah. thinking you've probably won already anyway, so... Close it down. Oh! Just a little Landed soft, didn't it? A little bit short. So you can see nicely. that, just show them the face, Chris, and they'll see that... So initially when it... I mean, the, the, ideally the camera's here, mate. Oh. So, <laughs> so when it came, it did have the sticker on it. I took that off and kind of wanted it to go rusty for this test, so we had those kind of extra little bit of maybe spin that what Taylor made claim you get with that. It does look great, doesn't it? It does look very good. More industrial, I think, down at the ball. Nice weight to it as well. So again, could play them. Had a little bit of bounce on all of those shots, but I just landed them a little bit short. Not bad. Thank you very much for setting those out, Chris. So the wedge, just like the MG2 wedges, does have the ZTP grooves. Don't really know what that means, but apparently they're good. It's also got a TPU inset in the back for a bit of vibration dampening, just in case you skull one, like I'm probably about to do. Chris, I'm gonna go back of the stance like you did to start with, because that was your best one. Oh, I'll tell you what, six. Ooh. It was close, just ran past. Yeah, I was quite happy with that, to be fair. A little bit toey, but. So, what are you gonna do now? Forwards or keep it the same? I'm gonna keep it the same until I get one inside yours. All right. That all right you, you do definitely see that you know when you move it with this geometric sole it kind of sits nicer to the ground yep you but can see it doesn't the leading edge doesn't come off the ground too far in pro shops people will be doing that and the sole will be absolutely kind of knackered before people even buy it cream but. crackered some would say oh came off a bit high 
try to run out. It's close. Still think I'm winning. Last one. Last hoorah. Ooh. Three good shots, average wise. Average wise, you might have won, but we weren't doing that, so thanks for coming. Oh, we're not. I 1 we were. 0. Oh, okay. Also, guys, if you have bought the Tailor Made Limited Edition P70W irons and they came in, it, let's just show these before. Uh, you missed a green with one of them there. That's uh, How can you claim that? It was on the edge. Oh, was it? So Chris has won with that closest one. That was my. Yeah. Not really my best, is it? But where next? Bunker. But as I was saying, so the TaylorMade P7TW irons come in a lovely display box. If you want this wedge in a display box, you can ask for it as well. Ooh, you like so it. if you're that kind of guy who just wants a bit of a shrine to Tiger, which... Most of us do. Yeah, most of us do. Is he the best? He is the man. Yeah, there'll be people saying Jack Nicholas, but that's probably generational, isn't it? I respect Jack Nicholas, but I think Tiger... Anyway, we'll not go into it, we'll not go into it. I shall let you go first, because you won last time. Chances of catching that. You're not waiting for them, are you? I'm not going to lie, they're in, they're in the eye line. <laughs> <laughs> oh, if he's in trouble, there's something wrong. Are you, are you waiting? Well, I don't want to kill him, do I? <laughs> oh, I'll tell you what. Tiger Woods wedges straight in the bag, no questions asked. Pattern. Channeling you in a tiger. Mm, I like that one. A little bit less loft on this one, I think. Same technique. Just no need. It's just a bit of a master class. I might get these wedges. It's a friendly channel, this, you know. Do you feel like anything's helping you in particular that it wouldn't do on the normal MG2? Like the sole or anything? Because all it is is a different grind, realistically, and then a TW stamp on it. Yeah. It's obviously in Tiger's right. specs, if you notice as well, so his shaft and his grip and things like that. Yeah, I like the weight of it. It really does feel good that you can be quite aggressive with it. Again, the sole, it just feels it can be quite, again, just aggressive. Versatile. It's versatile. See there, the first time I had it wide open, second time closed it down a little bit, and that helped me out. Well, I mean, look at those two. So, last one. Oof, that would have killed him over there, wouldn't it? Ooh, we had plenty of spin, though. <laughs> plenty of spin. Funnily enough, do you remember when we... Well, do you remember? You won't forgot. But when we spent some time with Bob Vokey, and Bob actually said, obviously, Tiger basically engineered the wedge shaft, didn't he? Because he yeah. wanted the heavier shaft, so... Heavier, so you don't have to swing it as hard, which means if we can swing smoother, we've got a lot better chance of returning the loft. It's more control, really. Versatile. Right. Are we going average or closest? Closest. Versatile. Looks great. That's a, you, you've got the fulcrum there perfectly as well, haven't you? Fulcrum. I did. Ah, oh, incredible. Right, cameraman. Playing these just from where? Yeah, they're all set up for you. I'll give you good lies. Oh, the rust's come off now. Rust's come off with the sand. Bit of sandblasting. It's a great one to start, but I still think I'm the closest. Never. Take two. Just glided through the sand that. Can I move it out of your footprint? You can, it's not in it, but if you want to tee it up. Oof. Didn't commit to that yeah, one as much. That wasn't the best. I don't think mine's closer, but... No chance. I'll commit to this. He's committing to this one. Again, just didn't turn through, leaked it to the right. That could be right those last two, weren't That they? could Some be. I'm sure mine's closer. Could be 2-0 and another win on the I channel. See, looking at this angle, I'm not being funny. 
Well, I'll get my feet out if I need to. I mean, I don't know how I feel. You know what? That one's not bad. I'm trying to claim it. Yeah, actually. Bloody hell. Got a caravan between my ball and yours. It's caravan? What a right? random thing to say. Caravan. Caravan? Have you hooked a caravan up to the new car yet? You better believe it. So at least we've got up and down uh, once. Once. I mean, right. you've got to lose a point for that one. You've degreened it. No, I was going for the backspin, see how it works. Right. Right then. So what's Tiger's favourite shot? So we know, well, it's not actually Tiger's, it's probably his enemies. Fill the thrill. Yeah, I think the mates now. Oh, they are. I've seen that thing today. So we're going to... Fill the thrill. Fill the thrill. We're going to do flop shot. James's Short, favourite. Short-sided. Short-sided. Double equipped. We're going to give James a chance to at least get a tie. If he wins this one, we're going to give him a draw. They do nice. look good, don't they? It's a nice wedge. I'm not I'm not sure if it's just come on focus. I'm not sure if it's just that TW that gives it the extra bit of Yeah, I think je ne sais quoi. Je ne sais quoi. Are you going first or am I? No, I think the problem is I've been putting too much pressure on you, so I'm gonna give you the honour as well. You've been putting too much pressure on I'm just that much of a swell coach that I'm gonna give you the time to shine. You hit a few, get all the sand out the grooves. From the bunker shot and then i'll go you know it other than that be the ball is it into the wind this way? it's off the right so open it up let it fly oh yips <laughs> didn't he's that. got the yips oh it's delightful See, I knew this was your time to shine. That was beautiful, wasn't it? I don't know if you're going to beat that one. The turf contact there was something quite phenomenal. Um, the turf contact. Here we go. Take two. Oh, it's another delightful shot. How's that kicking right there? Oh, it's kicked right, but it's closer by two or three inches. Right, here we go. Can he get this one? Tell you what, close. I'll let you tee it up. No, because I want to actually test it. Oh, he's testing it. Right, so it's a reasonable right. He's chucked the bounce at it, and it's it's got away a little Two bit. Two out of three one. there, I'm incredibly happy with. Two out of three ain't bad. He knows his meatloaf. Right. I think that's enough. There we go. Knee knocker for you, this. Knee knocker it is, to be honest. Right. Some loft. Far. You almost slid straight under that, didn't you? It was lovely. Just a bit. It's a bit too much. Shorter swing, same action. Yeah, good distance. It's it's strange because you'd expect that to bounce in that way to the left, wouldn't you? Yeah, I don't know how it's kicked. Yeah, it got, caught me off. Right, come on, nothing special now. Just a little dinker down into the back of it. Go on. That's the worst camera work ever, but I think. I don't want the average this time, but I think. Are we going one one spinner in there for the uh, grand t winner? Well, I like to call it a tie. If you, lose you can't again, call it a tie. If you lose again, it's not right, is it? They're going to stop tuning in. They'll stop tuning in if we give it an honourable tie. It's not the Ryder Cup, the concession. Come on, we'll leave the camera here the and we'll play one spinner in from the fairway down there, Tiger style. Right. One ball. One ball. One ball is the camera all right here? Does it need to be further back for you, like that bloke? I'd go further back and zoom in. Ooh, that's, yeah, good idea, that. Not very often you have a good idea, but when you do... Yeah, they didn't even stay on camera, they're there. Yeah. But, tough shot, weren't it? Yeah, it's impossible. Well guys, we chose pretty much the impossible shot to have the tiebreaker. Chris won just. That's terrible, that really, isn't it? But, um, guys, thank you so much for watching. Really hope you've enjoyed that. If you have enjoyed it, make sure you do hit that subscribe button below. Tiger's favourite club, finally got my hands on it. I'm yet to get my hands on the irons. 
Only a matter I of had time. a go actually in Australia with Tiger's actual driver from the tour van. Oh, Alex yes. just had one like in his specs and stuff. That was really, in fact, I'll tag that in this video because that was really good. And I put this bit of spiel in the beginning of the video as well because people, not? people might, not? might want to see it, but I've not tried the irons yet. So hopefully I'll get my hands on them. Um, yeah, what do you think guys? Hit those comments below. Would you go these? Would you go Tiger's specs or would you go standard MG2 wedges? What would you do? You've done well with them. Yeah, I'd go for this. I like to, uh, especially out of the bunkers, I found it a lot better than... Uh, if Tiger wasn't specs. using these, I think they'd still release them and just call it the V-grind. Yeah, and then would it be more popular or less? Versatile grind. I know what it would be. Less. Less. <laughs> <laughs> and apart from that guys, I'll, uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Not saying bye to him. See you